Hey everyone, in this video I wanted to show you how to cancel contracts and refund bitcoins from Huddle Huddle Bitcoin Exchange. You can see that in the window on the right I have this um, Megan bot logged in and I'm going to try to buy a little bit of bitcoins from Megan and I'm going to create a contract with her I click accept offer and create contract. Now she gets a notification immediately and Let's click on it. And now she would have to create a new payment password because she she had never uh, sold any bitcoins before. And confirm payment password. Now, here's the escrow address and uh, Megan would have to send bitcoins to that address. Okay, and let's check funds arrival. Oops, there's an error. And the problem here is that Megan actually sent 0.01 bitcoins when a little bit more was required by the exchange, and you can see that. Um, so it's not gonna be a big problem for us because she would be able to immediately refund the deposit. And uh, here's her Bitcoin address from the profile, but she decides to to send to refund the bitcoins to another address and let's get that address from the wallet here it is we'll just copy that address and paste it into the field and then confirm the payment password and here we go there's a release transaction ID you can click on it and see the transaction and you can see that the exchange uh, didn't actually take any commission we just uh, subtracted a little bit for the transaction fee from the 0.01 bitcoins that Megan originally sent now let's create another contract oops the Bitcoin price has changed and I would have to refresh the page for it to work. This is a slight inconvenience. It's actually because I clicked the back button in the browser. Uh, we're going to fix that in a, in a little while. So in this case, um, Megan is going to send the right amount of Bitcoins, but I'm going to cancel the contract after Megan deposits the Bitcoins. And we'll see what happens in this case. It's actually not going to be that much different. Okay, let's send the Bitcoins first. check the funds let's check the transaction was broadcasted okay now let's say I just realized I don't have any money in the bank so I can't pay Megan for the bitcoins now what I would do is cancel the contract and now Megan would be able to refund the deposit immediately just as she did before when she herself canceled the contract and we're going to send bitcoins to the same address from the wallet. Just paste it here and confirm payment password. And once again, we can see the release transaction and everything's fine. Now, let's create another contract. And in this case, Megan is going to deposit her bitcoins, but then she would change her mind and without clicking the I've sent the funds button, she would try to cancel the contract. And let's see what happens in this case. So entering the payment password once again to confirm. And uh, now we're going to deposit the Bitcoins. Just like we did before. However, we will click cancel contract immediately after that and you can see that the transaction was picked up. It was picked up anyway and now I can safely refund my deposit because the contract is canceled. So once again, that was absolutely no problem for Megan to, to refund the deposit from the escrow address. 
Now let's take a look at another case. And in this case, we're going to create a contract in which in which Megan is going to deposit the funds, but she would do that at a later point so that when she cancels the contract, no transaction is broadcasted, so there would be no funds to refund at this point. We'll just click Cancel Contract, and you can see there is a Check for Funds button. So, just in case, Megan sends funds to the escrow address at a later point in time by mistake, she still would be able to check for funds and check for a new transaction broadcasted and then refund them back into her wallet. This is it. Thanks for watching. You can go ahead and check it out for yourself on testnet.hodlhodl.com. If you have any questions or suggestions or bug reports, you can join our Telegram group and you can also follow us on Twitter. The links are on the screen. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a good day.